Have you ever seen crowds of non-Muslims enthusiastically queue to learn about the Qur'an? Well, for three days at this year's London Book Fair, the Review of Religion's Al Qalam project was inundated with visitors from every background. The project, which has run at Jalsa Salanas around the world in recent years, allows contributors of every faith the opportunity to write a verse of the Qur'an on a single, publicly prepared manuscript. Well, the experience was very spiritual, writing a verse out of a very special book. It's a surreal experience. Uh, I'm not sure why, but the hair on my hand stood on end. I think this project is amazing. I think it's a really, um, it's a really powerful thing to do. It was really nerve-wracking. One of the people who came said this is the only hands-on activity that we could find at the whole London Book Fair. So they would come, they would actually go through the exercise of writing a verse, asking what the translation is. That gave us an opening to talk more about the Jamaat, to talk more about Islam, to talk more about the Promised Messiah, more about the Khulafa. The display, which included historic manuscripts of the Qur'an and offered visitors complimentary Arabic paintings of their name, attracted extensive media attention. About six, seven, eight media outlets have come. Geo News came here. There was a BBC journalist here earlier. The London Book Fair official Twitter account retweeted regarding the Al-Qalam from different Jamaat counts over 15 to 20 times over the two days. London Book Fair Live, which has its own YouTube channel, also came. We had a Middle Eastern TV channel which goes all over the Middle East come. We had another channel from a Pakistani TV station that come. We had a Romanian press agency that come. So in short, due to Hazur's prayers and due to the blessings of this Holy Quran project, Al Ghalam, which is founded by Rizwan Begsab, we've been able to break through a lot of barriers. After writing their verse, guests had the translation and commentary explained and visitors of every age left more than happy. Dale Ahmed, MTN News.